Okay, right now I'm going to show you guys how to get VNC on your iPod. Most of you probably don't know what it is, so I'm going to show you right now. Basically, it's a remote desktop application. It like lets you do whatever you want on your iPod. Uh, er, it basically lets you do everything you can on your computer with your iPod if you have it installed. So if I open up YouTube on here, then it would pop up on here when I don't have to touch anything. All I have to do is just touch it on my iPod and it'll open up. Okay, watch. There we go. I can put it back down if I want. And then... Yeah. I'll show you guys how to get that right now. Alright, the first thing you need to do is go into Installer and install all packages go down until you get to VNC VNC right there yeah so install that And press home. Slide to unlock. And then you should see VNC. Okay. Now that you have that installed, just set it to the side for now. And go to the link that I gave you in the information. So the page will look like this. So then you need to go down to Ultra VNC 1.0.2 Stable. And then click the setup. Click Ultra VNC 1.0.2 setup. Click that. Then it should redirect you, and then you should see the box that pops up like this. Save the file. And then download it. I, ha I already have it installed, but yeah. Okay, then once you have it installed, just click the setup or open it up and then click OK and then next accept don't need to read that next next then just leave everything how it is don't do anything special unless you want to have like a desktop icon then you can do that if you want okay then just click next until it's installed I'm just gonna exit out of it because I already have it and once you have it installed, just go into Ultra VNC Server. It'll be a blue eye call, it, called Ultra VNC Server. So double click that. The screen will pop up like this. You should set a password, but I guess you don't really need to. But I'm going to just type in whatever you want, but remember it. Don't do anything else, just leave everything how it is. And then click Apply and then okay so then another little blue eye should pop up in this tasks thing can't really see that but I'll take a picture of that okay once you have that go back into your iPod Oops. okay go back into your iPod and click on the VNC icon then go up into the corner to the plus sign and click Click it. So the name, just enter in whatever you want. I'm going to enter in laptop. Okay, then for the host name, go down to the little blue eye and then just hover over it. Don't click anything. And then you should see the IP address or host name that you should enter in there. So do that. Okay, do that and then enter in your password that you have. My dog's name. Okay, then click save. And then click 
the server or name that you have and then in a few seconds depending on how fast your internet connection is it should open up and you should be inside of your computer so yeah I hope I helped you and if you have any questions just message me and I'll try and answer them as best as I can